This is the video where I tell y'all the true go-to products, the true self-care products that'll actually get you right, okay? Purple rain turn into the party seat. They try to moralize anything. Sailor on his life sketches too. This jimbo color not purple too. Probably that I have for my family. When I come around, that's why I'll be bold. What is up you guys? It's me Nubia here and on today's video I'm back with a new monthly must-haves and this is probably gonna be one of the last for this year. Is the light bothering y'all? I hope not. I mentioned in the last in the last new monthly must-haves that I was trying a lot of these out and I was gonna update you guys so I finally have the self-care products I actually use and a lot of it was that I just went back to originally what I started using, like my original products instead of trying new stuff. I just stuck with what I know. So I'm going to just go with things like I'm going to just pick things up as I have them because I don't really have it organized. But let's just start with everything outside of what you put on your body and mostly in your body. So I have two teas for you guys for this video. Two teas that I find help me so, so much, especially during uh, this season. The first tea is, if you don't know, I have really bad allergies, really, really bad allergies. Fragrance allergies especially, but regular allergies. I love Sleepy Time. So, oh crap, I'm not even showing y'all. Sleepy Time Sinus Soother. Listen, this stuff. First of all, it puts you to sleep. That's number one, which I love. I like, I love having like a tea that can naturally put me to sleep instead of taking like the sleepy pills with the diphenhydramine in them. So I love using this and then it also helps with sinuses before I go to bed. So I'm not sneezing when I wake up and all that. The next thing that I use, if you're cramping, I somebody asked me on Twitter about it, but if you cramp a lot, you're not the person for taking um, acetaminophen, all that, Advil, all of that. I love raspberry leaf tea. Oh my goodness. This one, when I first tried it, I'm like, there's no way that this could really get you. The good thing about teas is that they go straight to the system. So instantly I was feeling good when I use um, raspberry leaf tea. Those are two teas I really rely on. Now let's get into the rest. So boom, next thing. Let's get into shower. So shower. It's a lot. I still shower with my sponges. Somebody told me that they went to the dog store they couldn't find the sponges i live in florida so i don't know if that has anything to do with it if they don't have them at if they don't have them at the dollar store i don't get them don't get them if they don't have them at the dollar store because these are a dollar and they like to tax you at cvs they like to tax you at walgreens you guys know how they like to do it at walgreens and cvs all the time like every single freaking time it's body wash i try to avoid anything that'll throw me off anything that i'm talking about anything anyone that'll throw me off so when i look for body washes i look for things that are like no parabens no sulfates no dyes no freaking what's that thing called no fragrances all of that you're really supposed to use bar soap not doing that so i found the soap this is ren pures y'all i love this stuff I love this stuff right here. I just got the coconut milk and vitamin E because they have a matching lotion. They have a whole bunch of flavors, but this stuff smells so good. And the thing that I like to do is put a little bit of eucalyptus in it. All the benefits. Next, I have um, what I wash because I got a body wash and then I got what I wash in the crevices. I mentioned it in the last video, Yardley Oatmeal and Almond. Guess where I got this from, you guys? Dollar store, dollar store, dollar store, do, 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 do. It has no parabens and no sulfates. So automatically no preservatives and it's not gonna dry me out, boom. Now, what do I shave my legs with? I shave my legs with a razor. I still have the same routine for hair removal, but I shave my legs with a razor and I use this coconut oil and vitamin E bot silky shave oil from Bath and Body Works. If I'm not using this, I'm using conditioner, regular conditioner. Exfoliant, exfoliant, exfoliant. Now, if you've seen in my last video, I told y'all I made my own exfoliant. Quickly realized that that recipe was not good for anything. 
So the first thing that I get is this dry brush. It's from Eco Tools. It's a dry brush. I, it's a dry brush right here. It looks like this. Let me see. Looks like this. It you hold it like this and the thing is you don't even use it when you're in the shower it's dry I know this sounds really crazy now if you're the type of person you have super super sensitive skin this is not for you but me it's like I like a good exfoliate but what I'll do is I'll exfoliate with this before I get in the shower when my skin is dry like my legs everything that I usually exfoliate and then and then go in the shower either do my shave routine or use a second exfoliant that i'm going to show you the second scrub that i use i only use this two one to two times a week because the brushes don't have any ingredients in it the scrub itself has a lot of ingredients so i just try to stay away from too much stuff y'all that's really who i am like i was trying new things but i really try to stay away from too much stuff so right now i'm trying gg's no bump body scrub skin smoothing exfoliator the thing that i like about this is that i do feel the exfoliation now it's not like a like a sugar sugar scrub it's a light exfoliant it doesn't leave that oily residue of those like oil based exfoliants like you just get it off it just gets rid of what you need to get rid of it's like jelly it's like jelly now let's get into face so face face wash I told y'all I swear by this stuff I still have it from the last video because I got a huge huge bottle this is the desert essence thoroughly clean face wash love 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 there's no animal derived ingredients no animal testing no parabens no artificial fragrances or dyes mineral oil uh, petrolatum or paraffin, SLS, PEGS, PPG, MEA, DEA, TEA, I don't know. That's a lot of stuff that I would want to stay away from though. And propylene glycol or phthalate. So this is basically telling you it's homemade. Like somebody went, somebody went and figured it out. Next up we have what I use for facial scrub. Swear by it till this day. I think I uh, mentioned in the last video Freeman's gel mask and scrub polishing. This one will have your skin feeling like you're in it forever. And it's not one of those scrubs that have like one or two one or two little dots in it. No, it's a scrub for real. It's the real uh, deal. Toner, still using the Neutrogena pore refining toner. I just use it for the salicylic acid. Pore refining toner, can't go wrong with this, and that's all I gotta say about that one. Makeup remover. When it's time to take the makeup off, I need something that's gonna get in there and get the job done quick in a hurry. One thing about it, two things for sure, my cellar water. My cellar water, and this one's the green top. I also use it when I used to get lash extensions. I use it for my lash extensions too. So. It really, it's like all in one rather than buying the makeup wipes and then buying like this and da 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 da. And then the, what I use for moisturizer in the mornings, I actually have a DIY moisturizer, facial moisturizer. I told you guys I still have that same bowl of it. I still use it because it has, um, its base is really shea butter, which is a natural sunscreen. So I've been looking for a natural sunscreen that's not gonna wipe, like literally wash my face out, make me look like a ghost. So shea butter, shea butter, shea butter. And then I think it has like geranium, frankincense. And then at night, I use my Alcatru. I still have the same bottle. I use my Alcatru um, Alkaline Blemish Eraser. Nature, true nature is free, blah, blah, blah. Okay. Um, this, I still use this little bottle right here. Drop, drop, drop. And I love this stuff. I still use it. I still use it because slowly but surely it does what it needs to do. I feel like it reverses all the stuff that I went through that entire day and gets the job done. So I like using that. What I lotion with my body with is also Ren Pure. Uh, I have the same scent, the coconut milk and vitamin E. These bottles are 24 ounces and they're $5. I actually really do like this, this brand so much. And I have the the body wash and it's hydrating so i like the i like body washes that don't dry my skin out 
I hate body washes that make me feel like I have to douse myself in lotion before bed because that's one thing I'm not going to do ever in life. So I'm throwing this in here. I have no idea why, but edge control because I love this edge control so much. This is Bomb Collection Edge Control. This little tub right here. 3.5 ounces will run you a good $12, but I'm telling you, when I tell you rain, sleet, or snow, I don't have that, I don't have that edge control on now, but rain, sleet, or snow, it'll get you where you need to go. Now, outside of all this stuff that you guys saw me talk out, talk, look, talk, sorry, long day, I'm telling you. Listen, outside of all this stuff that I showed you guys in this video, one thing that has been helping me with not only my cycle, but my hair and my skin and everything is vitamins, vitamins, vitamins. I'm talking about like supplements, getting the individual vitamin itself and just taking them all like, like popping pills. So my mind's been feeling better. My hair's been growing i know y'all seen my lock journey video my hair's been growing ever since i started using the vitamins one is because i have them but i don't feel like getting up and showing one that i use is vitamin c vitamin c makes me happy vitamin c is vitamin c i use vitamin c i don't know nothing about it i was recommended vitamin d3 two as well and then zinc those are three vitamins that i definitely definitely take individually take your vitamins y'all that is also self-care products that you guys should invest in keep it simple that's one thing i learned because every single time i don't keep it simple i always learn my lesson always learning one thing about me i'm gonna always learn my lesson so if you have any 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 suggestions or anything about products uh don't be afraid to comment and we can talk so make sure to follow my social media which is going to be on the screen smack that in your face follow my social media follow my social uh, follow my social media <laughs> make sure to follow my hair page which will also be on the screen and book with me if you're in the tampa area and then last but not least make sure to like comment and subscribe because it helps helps it helps yeah, 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 yeah. Seriously, it helps. I'll catch you guys on Sunday's vlog. Yes, we're back on schedule. I'm sorry about what I was putting you guys through back in the day. It should be good. No, I'm kidding. I don't know what's going to be on Sunday's vlog. But I'll catch you guys on Sunday's vlog. Bye.